Well, this is my first time posting this video on YouTube, so I figured I'd I'd just tell you that on my channel you see a lot of videos of me working out. And I have progressively lost weight since then, but uh, I'm currently dealing with another issue. As you can see, my car is not exactly in the best shape, but that's pretty much my home right now. In fact, if you look in the back there, you can see some of my stuff, as well as some of the other stuff that's in my, uh, in my trunk. And the thing is, I am currently homeless and living out of my car. I... It has to do with uh, certain situations that could have been prevented had I been smarter. But uh, I'm not too worried about it at the moment. I collect, I collect $981 in disability and I collect another six, little over 600 a month uh, working weekend shifts at Walmart as a cart pusher. Walmart's not exactly my favorite thing to do, but uh, but it, it's extra income. So I do that. I, there's also something else I do on the side for extra money, but that's for a different video. Uh, this will be the first of occasional uh, selfie video selfie videos of me telling you about my housing situation. Uh, as we know, we're currently going through uh, through a year and a half into a pandemic, and one of the results is that there's a housing crisis going on. Uh, while I didn't lose housing due to COVID, as I mentioned, my foolishness cost me my housing. Uh, I'm trying to make the best of the bad situation. I'm glad that I have a vehicle. Although it could be in better shape. I mean, after all, if you look at it, you'll notice that it's about, it's got over 205,000 miles on it. So it's not exactly a top notch. And I'm having the engine looked at tomorrow. But uh, I, at least I'm grateful to not have debt to my name. I'm grateful that I'm getting healthier and healthier. Uh, my church friends are trying to help me. Uh, as I've struggled through these issues and uh, and as and uh, try to find housing, uh, one option is the fact that uh, my the mother of my child is getting out in 24 hours from prison, and she said that uh, once she's settled in, I can move in with her. But my church family openly does not support that. They think they claim they talk about how a man and a woman should not be uh, living together until after marriage. I'm trying to be respectful about their views, but it's kind of hard to do that when you are when you are dealing with a situation where you're a, a step away from living on a, in a tent on the streets. So I'll get more. Uh, details into that this, but this is like the introduction uh, introductory video of a series of videos about my current housing situation so I uh, keep stay in tuned and I will tell you more about it